Very simple and uh, short ang marching order. Sabi niya lang uh, to, to uplift the life of the bottom of the pyramid, you know. Uh, yung mga mahihirap, mas magkaroon ng kabuhayan, o mga tambuhay, uh, mga micro and small negosyante, tulungan din natin paano umangat. And medyo familiar siya na yan yung ginagawa rin ni Guan Negosyo. So I think uh, sa pagpili uh, po sa akin, baka yun yung mga na-consider nilang uh, factors. How to do it, bahala na daw ako. Are there any other systems you're gonna be putting in place? And Vicky, I'm gonna help with the financing part yeah. of the businesses. Right now, kasi, um, DTI, may mga attached agency that helps in financing, but it will have to harness all the other, other microfinance institutions, the, the rural banks, the thrift banks, uh, how we can uh, increase yung funding and financing, uh, making financing uh, much more available with a wider reach. No? will hopefully accelerate the opening of negotiation centers. At the same time, yung laman nun, meaning the, the people that will guide mga micro and aspiring entrepreneur na pupunta sa negosyo centers. You're also coming in at a time where the business environment is uh, a bit more challenging. There's the ASEAN integration, there's digital, there are tech startups now. Yes, it's yes. not just the small uh, businesses that we were used to before. Um, how do you plan to tackle these or really um, up DTI's presence in these? We will view them as opportunities rather than challenges. How can we therefore enhance all these uh, tools to enhance the business model of companies? In other words, using technology, social media, marketing, getting information, having market research through so social media or through internet. If there are inter internet uh, uh, access to the micro and small and, and if they can access the the, the internet and getting more information on products, uh, idea uh, designs, uh, design ideas, uh, then uh, you, you level the playing field. In other words, yung mga micro SME will, be, will have access to information that are available also to the bigger guys. To me, the role of DTI is uh, making sure lang that the com there's that competitive environment so companies will really compete. And when, when there's competition, companies will tend to produce better quality products at the lowest price possible. And one of the complaints to this day of some SMEs is that, uh, or those that want to start a business, is the number of steps that it takes to create a business. Now, the DTI has already helped with the one-stop shop and a lot of uh, initiatives, but how do you plan to maybe even shorten that process uh, even more? The getting permits from LGU, so kailangan may LGU cooperation then. Uh, permits, the forms, number of days of processing, uh, approval, siguro automatic, automaticity in approval. Uh, pagka tumatagal yung processing noon, dapat automatically approved na. Pag hindi nila inaksyonan, approved na. Uh, so, we will look into those uh, things. So, I know DTI is doing already its part in improving that, so we'll see how we can improve it further.